Rock's channel right now. Let's get it! What's up everybody? It's Brock and we're here with an episode of All About. And today we're going to learn about the good old Percula Clownfish, one of the most well-known saltwater fish you've ever seen. He's been in movies and all over everything. Your kid knows him right when he sees it. The price for these guys is $21.99. Tank size, 30 gallon, but really, I mean, it could be like a 10 if he's in there by himself or with a, another one. You know, he's a fish that you can put in a pretty small tank. Care level, super easy. Temper, they're semi-aggressive, which might surprise some people, but these guys, they get territorial. And like if another fish starts swimming by their anemone or a rock they've been swimming by, they might jump after them. So watch for that. Reef compatible, of course. Temperature, keep it 72 to 78. Keep your KH 8 to 12 and your pH 8.1 to 8.4. And your salinity 1.020 to 1.025. The max size that guys can get is about 3 inches. That's pretty normal to see. Colors on them, you'll see black, oranges, and whites. The diet they are omnivores, so you know, feed them like mysis and brine shrimp, the little frozen cubes. Compatibility, any, they can be paired. And with others too, you know, you could get this percula, and then you could go and get like a black oscillaris and pair them up together. You know, different stuff like that. You don't have to pair them with another percula clown. And... Their origin, they are captive bred. It's really, really rare. I've never seen it before. People getting clownfish from the wild. It's just not a thing anymore. They've gotten so big and so able to be able to captive breed them. That's just how they do it now. Now, a big question is, I want this dude to host two anemone. Now, you don't need an anemone if you want a clownfish. You don't have to get one. He can live without it. But the most chance of him hosting to an anemone are the rose bulb anemones. It's just the best luck I've seen with them. And I know my red maroon is, that's what he's in. He's in a rose bulb. Now they will get darker around their body and the stripes as they get older. So don't be surprised by that. And that's really all you need to know. It's a great, great fish to start out with. Because he's real easy. And he's pretty hardy too to survive any kind of crazy things you're learning as you're going along. But yeah, I mean, that's it. That's the peculiar clownfish. He's a simple, easy fish, one your kids will love. Y'all have a good day. Keep checking my channel for more episodes. And make sure to like and subscribe. Keep a comment below if you have any questions. See y'all later.